Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm going to do a small affordable haul. Actually, it's not small. It's a, it's a huge affordable haul. Uh, it consists of mostly makeup and some skincare items as well. So yeah, let's get on with the video because I have a lot to go through. And if you haven't subscribed yet, I would love if you could subscribe and hit on the notification bell as well since you'll get notified of all my future videos as soon as I post them. So first starting off, I want to go through my purple haul that I placed on purple app. So this is the thing that things that I got. This is the Stay Quirky BB Cream uh, that I got. I got this for 237 rupees and uh, this one I got in 0 to medium. I am actually going to do a very detailed review or uh, review and demo on BB creams available in India under rupees 300. So that is why I got this so that I can test it out. And then I got this lipstick. This is the NY Bay lipstick and it's in the shade sassy samba and i got this for uh, rupees 249 i actually have written down all the mrp here so that i don't get confused so i got this for 249 and i really really love this shade this is the shade that, that i am wearing it looks more pinky and a little bit more red but this is actually a brown and sometimes it can look a little brownie red on my skin tone but this is more on the brown side uh, on camera it doesn't look that brown but in real life it looks it is brown in color the next thing I got is this NY Bay liner and this is uh, in the shade 06 and I actually uh, don't like this liner at all because this doesn't uh, like let me just show you this has no pigment in it. It 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 does nothing on my lips. It, the 20 rupees liner that we get uh, is better than this. Any liner than this. Any liner would be better than this. That is what I want to say. This is like total shit. I really don't like this liner at all. And I wouldn't recommend you all to spend even your 100 rupees on this liner. So because I got two things from NY Bay, they gifted me this one. This is the NY Bay uh, nail paint and um, this is in the shade 18. So I don't like the shade at all. This is not something that I would wear, but since it's a free product, of course, thank you purple. But yeah, I really don't like the shade. Uh, I don't think I will ever wear this shade at all. So the next thing that I got is this darling Isabella concealer. It's in the shade 0. Five, and I really really like this concealer totally uh, this is only rupees 200 and I will again do a detailed video on this concealer and I'm going to show you guys how beautiful this is because it's only 200 rupees and I cannot get over the fact that a 200 rupees concealer can be this good so that is why I'm going to do a video soon so the next thing I got is this Good Vibes Papaya Mask. I have used this twice and this one retails for 223 rupees. And um, this one is like a generic face mask. Uh, it's nothing special. I like this because it does brighten up my face and gives a glow kind of effect. But other than that, this doesn't have any long term effects on my skin. So it's just a normal face mask that I use before doing my makeup. And because I got this from Good Vibes, they gifted me this one. This is the Good Vibes Shower Gel. This is so tiny, but this smells really, really good. Uh, I think I can use this up on like one go. But yeah, this is very cute and tiny. So I got this both from Purple again. And the last thing that I got from Purple is this Wet n Wild Lip Gloss. And this has been like there since day one. I feel like Wet n Wild has these lip glosses and they are so affordable. This is like 100 rupees. I personally am someone who do not like to wear lip gloss that much. But I was like, oh, let me try this gloss because it's just for 100 rupees. So I got this and yeah, I still haven't used this at all because I love matte lipsticks and I'm not someone who wears gloss that often. So the next things I got are from Amazon. 
Uh, this is the coconut serum. This is a coconut hair serum and I got this from Amazon. I just retailed for 170 rupees. It's from Parachute and I really like this. I use this today. Um, it does definitely controls my frizz and everything like that. It gives a little bit of shine. It's a good serum. It's just for 174 rupees so I cannot expect it to work wonders but it definitely is a good serum and I don't totally see myself buying this in the future so the next thing is this Levon shake and spray this is the first thing like my, my first time trying out this product because i used to have the Levon serum the normal Levon serum but i never had this specific one uh this is the spray kind where you can you know like literally spray this on your hair and just tame away the frizz i i do like it uh the smell is very very good um, it's not something I would repurchase, I guess. So this one retails for about 250 rupees. Uh, for 250, I do feel the price is a little on the higher side. But I mean, it's a one-time purchase for me. I'm not buying it anymore. So the next thing I got is a lipstick again. And this is the CAL lipstick. It's in the shade... Um, 15 and this is how the shade looks like this is the shade sun kissed and i actually thought this was going to look nude because the pictures online looked very nudey pink so that is why i got it i don't like the shade at all because this is not something that i wear at all i do not like pink lipstick on my skin tone i don't know why i don't like pink lipsticks and this is like a straight up pink lipstick so i don't know i don't think so i'm i'm going to be wearing this at all so the next thing I got from Amazon is this one. This is the Emoline Moisturizer. And again, I want to do a good moisturizer video. That is why I have been testing out a few moisturizers. I have tested this out like five times. I uh, put this on my face five times and I do like it. I have my thoughts on it and I will put that in a video soon. So this one retailed for... 274 rupees but i think they gave me like a 20 rupees off kind of a thing so i got this for 250 rupees so the price of the lipstick which i forgot to tell you guys is 288 rupees so another thing i got is this one this is a huge mask hair mask that i got and i have been using this hair mask ever since i got it i do really really enjoy this hair mask totally i really love it this is like the size of my head even more large than my head is uh, this retails for about uh, 295 this is like 300 and you get so much of product this is such a saver for me because i am like using this every time i wash my hair i always use this mask before uh, washing my hair so yeah i do feel my hair is very very soft after using that mask so the next thing i got from amazon is this like facial razor this thing i I always I go through this like water because I always like shave my face so I got one of these and then I got these eyelashes that I'm wearing today I used to use this eyelashes back in the day like uh, like it's been like three years or two years since I got these kind of eyelashes from Amazon and uh, after that I started to wear very like full-on heavy falsies and now I'm back to being natural so that is why I got this um, this retails for 380 rupees and this one i think it was for 120 rupees so the last thing i got from amazon is this blush it's from deborah and this is in the shade biscuit uh actually one of my subscribers she recommended this shade to me and i, I saw the shade i had it on my wish list but i never got around to purchase it but i really really am loving this blush this shade is so beautiful it's totally like my shade my kind of a shade so that is why i got it and this retails for about 300 rupees i think i got it for 294 rupees i got so i got two blush blushes and these are from a website named glam pick and these are the blushes that i got this is a sfr blush and it's in the shade 01 I like this shade so much, especially this shade is so beautiful. This is like a peachy, warm tone shade and this is like a pink shade. But this shade is so beautiful, looks so good on my skin tone. But the thing is, I don't like the formula of these. These are kind of too powdery and too matte. They look a little powdery on my skin. So I don't like the formula, but the shade is so pretty. 
So the next blush I got it's from the same company. This is the SFR Pure Color Blusher and this shade is so beautiful again. This is the blush that I have on my cheeks right now as you can see and this blush looks matte on the pen but this has like really tiny shimmers to it. This looks stunning on the cheeks and whenever I apply this blush I don't even need a highlighter but it doesn't look shimmery at all it just looks glowy and you're glowing from within but also you're blushing and you're glowing from within so the last products that I have to go through are from Nykaa and this is the pile of products that I have to go through. So the first thing I got from Nykaa is a moisturizer. This I got because one of my friends suggested it uh, and I really like the ingredients. This is hyaluronic acid and it has niacinamide in it as well and that is why I got it. This I got it for rupees 300 and when I purchased this I got a body wash of the same brand free and this is a body wash. This is a tea tree body wash and this has peppermint oil in it which is why it smells like Colgate it's straight up smells like Colgate I don't like the smell of it it feels like a toothpaste honestly I don't like the smell at all but other than that the fact that this is actually really really big and I got it for free I, I mean I'm thankful so the next I got are these Himalaya face wipes and I don't like to take my makeup off with face wipes because I don't really like uh, to tug my face with face wipes because obviously when you wipe your face with these kind of wipes you have to tug and pull your skin so I only use this because I swatch a lot of makeup on my hands and everywhere and that is the only thing I like to use when I remove uh, makeup from my hands and that is why I got only one packet of face wipes and then I got this BB cream from from, from from Pons. Then I got this BB cream from Pons and this one retails for 125 rupees and I got a Garnier BB cream as well and this is for 75 rupees and I also got a CC cream from Lacme and this is in the shade bronze. Garnier has only one shade and the Pons BB cream I got it in the shade medium and as I said I am going to do a review on all of the BB creams that I got. So currently I am wearing Pons on my face. I do really like it. I used to wear Pons BB cream back in the day like five years ago I think so I used to wear Pons BB cream but now I don't anymore but again I got it in the shade medium so I got another BB cream this is the Swiss Beauty BB cream and this is in the shade 04 I just wanted to show you guys how 04 looked like because this shade is 04 I what how in the world is this shade 04? I, I just, I don't understand how, how and how brands formulate their products this way. I mean, 04. Wow. I thought when I got 04, I thought it was going to be too dark for me because, I mean, this is snow white. This is a snow white shade and I am nowhere near this and this is the last shade they had so right there i'm giving you guys my review i don't like this bb cream at all although i'm definitely going to put this in the review but um so i got few wow what was that so i got few of these uh maybelline fit me shape, shape packets uh these are sample packets and i think i got this free from Nykaa. They gifted this to me because I think I got uh, a, a lot of products. That is why they were like, this is your free sample from Maybelline Fit Me. And But I just don't understand that how am, how did they know that I am in the shade 230 because I really am in the shade 230 in Maybelline Fit Me and I don't understand how Nykaa exactly gifted this to me. In my right shade so another thing I got is this one this is a Lotus um, safe Sun actually it's a sunscreen and this is the 40 SPF sunscreen I have been using this for three days now I really really do like this actually I really do enjoy this sunscreen this is a matte formulation it doesn't leave a white cast on my face at all it gives me that matte kind of finish although I have dry skin I do want my 
skin to not look greasy throughout the day and this has been really really helpful in doing that so the last thing i got from nika and this whole haul is this one this is the la18 lipstick and it's in the shade b41 i don't like this shade at all this shade doesn't suit me at all it doesn't look flattering whatsoever it just looks very grungy and it looks very weird on my skin tone um i just don't like it at all i am going to give this to someone else so that was it for today's video i hope you guys liked it i know this video wasn't that good because i had to refilm this video time and again because i had so many products to go through i had a lot i listed all the prices here uh it was really very confusing for me so i really hope you like it if you have any queries about any of the products that you saw here definitely uh feel free to comment down below i always reply to you guys and also if you are new please definitely hit that subscribe button thank you so much for watching i love you all so much i'll see you in my next one bye bye